guys and welcome to my channel Flame of Four. In this video we're going to be doing issue 28. So issue 28 includes uh, car parts stage 103 and 104. So we're going to be doing issue 103 and 104 and in the next set of issues we're going to be doing stage 105 and 106. So uh, what we need to do is we will just need to go to page here and then we're doing 100 stage 103 the rear window frame and air vents so that's going to be pretty cool um so that's just here i'm going to go grab a mount and we'll be back in just a sec so guys all the pieces are out now so as you can see we have the stick on edgings as well um they kind of want us to bend these into shape again which is it can sometimes be annoying but um we're just going to go roll with it uh, so just test fit them in first make sure you're happy so this one needs bending around quite a bit just bend them in shape just a little bit at a time until you're happy with the gaps so i'm happy with that one i'm going to go stick that one in so this is going to be 103 b and this is the first section to so stick on to this lens and we're sticking it onto the frame which is 103 a what I want to do is just line all that up and then push it into place. So that is that side there. As you can see, that's 103B on 103A. We're going to now go and put on 103D, which is going to be this top section here. It is quite bent, so I'm going to just bend it the other way around and then perhaps just test fit it to make sure it doesn't try and rise off there see if that fits on there okay yep do on that section there so that is the top frame so i'm just going to pop that there for a moment we do need to go grab the door because what we're going to be doing is going to be installing 103 e which is this vent and this is a different way to how we installed the one on the vent on the um, bonnet because we got the Mike Lane ones because there were screws on the outside and they look hideous. Although they don't look very well grilled, he probably will make something for this. I'm hoping to uh, make something a little bit better than what we have there. So that just goes into place. And then on the inner side, it's gonna get a couple of screws, are uh, the EP screws. So I'm just gonna start them off with this one. It wants them to look so that you've got this bit here and you've got that bit there but we are going to go and continue to do the next one so what we're going to do is we're going to grab all the pieces out for stage 104 we're going to grab those and then we're going to be back in just a sec okay we've got all our pieces out for stage 104 just having a quick look on here what it wants us to do so i guess in this window doesn't go up and down because i'm guessing it probably really doesn't need to um so what it's saying is for us to fit the window inside here so let's just have a quick look how it wants it to go in so yeah the window fits inside just like that and then it goes over the top of this like so and holds it all into place so let's have a look how easy or hard it's going to be to get that in so it wasn't too bad so what it wants is it to sit in there like that with the frame around it and then those poke through this side so you can see them from the inside so along the top edges we need to put the we need to put two EP screws, so we're gonna go ahead and do that now. And then along the bottom are BM screws. So we're gonna do that and then we'll be back in just a sec. So there you go, guys. So on that one there, we had um, the EP screws at the top. So there was one up here, just on the top edge there, one up here. And then along the bottom there are the BM screws. So there's one, two, three BM screws. What we need to do next is we need to make up this door locking mechanism, which is usually a bit of a tricky one to do, but I think I've done enough of these now to maybe be an expert at doing them because they, are, they can be tricky, but we're gonna be fine. Let's see if we can do it first time. 
So that goes through there, sits into that recess like so. In there, and then we need a DM screw. Perfect. So, as you can see there guys, that's the door locker mechanism. So you want 104D, which is the main flat piece, which the screw goes into, 104C is the spring, 104B is the locking mechanism that pushes in and out like that. And then it's held in by a DM screw, and then it should sit at the side like this and look like that on the inside. On the outside again, we will need to get our little tiny lock and that will need to go into the door. And again, that is sided so that it only fits in one way. So just try and get it around the way that it's going to go in. When you get it close, push it down into place. There we go. Doesn't need anything else. And then there you have it. So this is what it should look like at the end of the stage 104. How cool does that look? Especially with that like that Mike Lane mod on there as well. Looks absolutely incredible. Right, let's have a quick look and put these screws away at the same time. See what we're gonna be doing in the upcoming ones real soon. Just pop these screws away. That was a BM right in there. There we go. Right, so in the upcoming issues, we are going to be doing stage 105 inside rear door parts. And then we're going to be doing, with that, we're going to be installing it by the looks of it. And then we're going to be doing 106, which is the right rear fender and skirting. So can't wait to do that with you guys. If you like this video, give us a thumbs up. Please subscribe by clicking the button just down here. And remember to set the bell so you don't miss out on any more videos. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Take care now. Bye-bye.